brought me gems, have you? Here. More gemstones for your collection. See? How can there be an invasion with so many gems lying around? Here. More gemstones for your collection. You're very useful. For a foreigner. Here. More gemstones for your collection. Oh, so sparkly. I'll see what I can find for you. Why are you here? working so hard that even my calluses have blisters? can help me find a suitable Jotun. Perhaps if I listen to that chatter, some fount of wisdom will feel itself. You can't help. You don't trust me. The moose bears have come for a fight. We will give them a fight. <laughs> yes! <laughs> they may try us with fire, but little do they know what What will it be? Let me see to that. Will it be yes? Come back. Something else? We'll speak again. to humiliate us some more? Help me, and I'll compose you a saga so exalted it will endure Ragnarok itself. But first, I need a name and a place. For what? For whom? The mightiest Jotun in all of Svartalfheim. We know the one. Right hand of Sjotunga. Malviger. Here because of us. She is... worthwhile. Gave your son Vidar quite the beating once, didn't she? One day Vidar will make me proud. But why would Malvika care about you two? Premier and Lom aren't our real names. <laughs> Allow me to introduce... Fiala and Gala. The ones who killed... Sutinger's father. I heard something about him trying to outdrink a couple of dwarves. And after, befuddled, tripping and breaking his neck. <sighs> Sutinger wasn't happy. Held us responsible. But luckily we'd acquired some mead. Some special mead. And well, Sutinger is partial to a bit of mead. We bartered it in exchange for our lives. Except afterwards, some thieving twat went and stole it. Loki, most likely. It's always Loki. Whoever it was, Sutunga didn't catch them. So he decided to take it out on us instead. Sent Malviga to hunt us down. Been incognito ever since. Can't trust this lot not to sell us out. Still, she hasn't found us yet. She will. 
Balvigar's dangerous prey, even for you. But we can help balance the scales. Our old house, north of here, sunk in a lake. Inside, upstairs on a table, you'll find a cup of great potency. Cup? You know, the cup. Oh yes, the cup. Has the power to do wonderful stuff. For instance... So, I bring you the cup, and then... We show you how to use it against Malfigur. It's a deal. I should find a way inside. Looks like I'll be getting my toes wet. a cup in the first place. To leave one of your enemies alive, so they can tell of your greatness. Everyone knows of my greatness. Perhaps there are one or two who have not yet heard? Just tell me where Malvigor is. What... what's in it for me? I do not know, but I will tell you this. The longer you make me wait, the worse it will be. <sighs> Malvigor is at the den to the west. And now? Will you spare me? Until next we meet. <laughs> there will be no next. You can be sure of that.
rugged views that remind me of when I once roved the land with fear. He enjoyed the solitude as much as I, and the trouble and danger even more. And then came the war with the Vanya, taking Freya as my bride. It helped end that strife, but it ended many other things too. What trickery is this? For you, High One, I would have brought an army. No, Sutengar will have his vengeance, but not here. I know why you have come. I have a bone to pick with you. After what you did to my son, Vidar, I must. Vidar put up an honorable fight. That is not what I heard. Do not believe the stories. Upon his return, too weak to stand, he squirmed like a worm caught in the sun. <laughs> you should have seen me. My acolytes had to carry me home on their backs. No. Your boy fought well. Is that why you spared his life? It is. But you aren't here to avenge Vidar's honor. You have come to steal my Hugar. And I intend to stop you. How do you know this? Esir. Yotu. You and Loki are both mad. And Hirokin is just as bad. And Thor? is so stupid he might as well be mad. You spread chaos wherever you go. Yet, you are all known quantities to us. Surtur is not. He rarely emerges from Muspelheim. And when he does, he shares little with us. Thus, while here, I have sent my spies to learn what he plans. Beyond wiping out the dwarves like he did the elves of Alvain. What do you know of his plans? I know that he found a powerful elven relic, and that his minion, Calder, was tasked with finding the Hugaris necessary to sustain it. That Calder is now trapped within said relic, and that you would have me join him. I must trade the Salakar for my son. You? The one who almost killed Sutengard for his meat? We'll hand over a legendary relic, take your son and leave. Just like that. <laughs> Put your mania aside, Havi. Work with me. Together we will foil Surtur's ambitions. I cannot take the risk. With each breath, Baldur is a step closer to death. I was a parent once. But we must look beyond ourselves, for the good of all. We have spoken long enough. So...
what you came here to do. Get on with it, blind one. End my misery. Oh, Ymir. True, oh father. My body comes to you. Sent by the same ambassador who claimed your own. As for my Hooger, do not weep for me. I do not deserve this. No, you do not. This is the old workshop that Evaldi spoke of. I should check if it's already here. The entrance must be on the other side. Oh, utterly useless. Where is a decent soul? Found anything worthy of your talents? This will have to do. Soon you can put them to good use. 
My Emir. Is that a... a Salakar? I never knew they actually existed. I know all the Sarkis of your people, yet I've never heard I of... never said my people. You mean the Light Elves? There aren't many who remember the Children of Light or their stories. I do. When Sutter invaded their lands, they begged me for aid. The war with the Vani had only just ended and I was... wary. Long after, I learned how Sutter devoured the Elves in mortal light, Uga by Uga. Maybe it's the same light that now allows him to renew himself after death. During the conquest, he must have uncovered knowledge of the Salakars. But to what end? What Hugers does it hold? Those of two warlords. One a Muspel, the other a Jotun. Nothing more? Nothing more. At least not of value. He speaks the truth. You deal with a fire nymph? A fire nymph? I am the finest fire nymph in all of Svartalheim. Allow me to introduce Asa, Treasoner's daughter of Sutra, and my friend. You grow dewy eyed in your dotage. What have you unearthed? Only rumors. My father is rebuilding something large and powerful. Though its exact nature, I cannot fathom. And the Salakar is intended to be part of this... this something. Most likely. Either way, its value to my father is so great, he may indeed trade your son for its return. Return to your stepmother. Arrange a trade. And one more thing. I would feel better knowing you are protected. Sinmara travels far and wide, but I will rejoin her as you wish. Whatever the Salakar is, I must steal it back once Baldur is safe. Why? Ragnarok comes. I've made plans, but they are not ideal. Perhaps the Salakar offers another way. One that will allow me to truly save those I care about. Even you. Mm, to unlock its secrets, I will need help. There are rumors of a shelter nearby. Its dwellers may be able to assist me. Try looking near the largest karst south of here. Tell them I sent you. No dwarf would give up the chance to work with Ivaldi. Langren was once home to your rivals, Sindri and Broca. Your name may not carry much weight here. Don't make me laugh. No one cares about those two. I'll follow you once I've finished taking what I need. This land bears deep affliction.
Shelter's close. Feel it. The evil they spoke of. I should head inside. How can so many starving dwarves? A word, my friend. 
Evaldi requests your aid. <laughs> Ain't my concern. Go talk to Augler. He's the master of this workshop? Master? <laughs> nah, but he's chief when the masters ain't here. Let's see. Which one is up? Do I look like I got time for small talk? You Can't you see I'm busy? Just ask someone else. Let's talk again. Good to see. from Ivaldi. What do I care? Go talk to the Ganger. Ganger? Yeah. The chief. Name's Oakler. sends me. He requires the help of a skilled artisan. A meeting of minds, huh? Well, it ain't up to me. You'd best talk to Brokir or Sindri. They still breathe? Where are they? No idea. Sindri went off adventuring. He does that. Mind you, it's been a while since he left. How much of a while? Couple of weeks. And his absence doesn't worry you? Not my business where he goes. And Brokir? Went to look for Sindri. <laughs> Bit of a worry guts, that one. Ever since he mucked up the forging of Mjolnir. Anyway, look, leave your name and I'll pass it to Broker when he shows up. Tell him Harvey of Asgard was here. Harvey of... by Ymir? Really, it is you? I'll return tonight. In the meantime, fetch Ivali. He's at the old workshop ruins. <laughs> <laughs> 